Okay, everybody, hello. This is my new YouTube video, and I hope you guys can hear me over the music. Here, let me try to turn it down a little bit. Alright, we should have a game. I'm doing a YouTube video on my boy's Wonderland shop for Smoke Shop Devotics products, and uh. I kind of want to introduce you to the iPrib kit. It's a really good kit. Let me turn this down a little bit more. Alright, so look. I just got in a prison gold iPrib kit by Smock. And mine just read off at a product. For 70 bucks, uh, plus tax, obviously. So here's what it looks like. Hope you guys can read all that. I'm going to read off the things that it comes with. Get you guys into, into the new tank. And uh, that I got with it. And... Tell you all the things that it can do and show you all the things it can do. One of the things I really like about the mod is that it's voice activation. It reads every voice of yours, all the commands. It comes with a little command card and it's really, really, really nice. So here we go. Here's the stuff that it comes with. One iProof kit, uh, which means mod. Uh, TFV12 Prince Tank, one. One TFV12 Prince Strip Coil, 0 0.5 ohms, pre-installed. One V812 mesh, or Prince Mesh Coil, 0 0.15 ohms. One times uh, 18650 battery operator. And one replacement glass tube one usb cable and one user manual and spare parts now i'm not using the prince tank on it because i do not like the prince tank most people do uh that's fine with me uh it's more what your preference is for it right now i'm using the profile tank that just came with it uh, no, not just came with it, but I mean uh, that I just got separately. And this is what it does so far. At 50 watts, it chucks. I mean, it really does good for 50 watts. And let alone, the batteries are really dying right now. So it's still pretty holding up in there. Yeah, it really works, so... Hope you guys like that. Now, see, I got a little cold right now, so it's understandable that you guys... See me wiping my nose and everything, and using tissue and shit like that. It's just... Runny nose, that's all I got, it's allergies. Alright, but... Alright, so, let's get into the tank and the mod. Right now, this profile tank, I got a blue one. Uh, I will later on, once the store gets more into these YouTube videos, be getting free tanks and vapes and products that I can hand out for free. Be the first to uh, see my new video and comment, pro uh, subscribe, and link below. And you'll be able to win a free vape. Now, it costs a little money to ship if you want to be shipped if you're out of state. Otherwise, you don't have to worry about nothing. It's completely free. All right. They call me Jackman, and I'm working for Wonderland. So here we go. Let me pause the music so you guys can hear what this thing does. Okay. So now, what I like about this meter, or this mod, is it got LED lights on the bottom, as everybody can see. And not only that, watch this. To get it started on the voice commands. Hello, iPriv. I'm here. 
Higher power. Power has been increased. Higher power. Power has been increased. Lower power. Power has been reduced. Lower power. Power has been reduced. Light change. Oops, that's messed up. Light color. Light color. Power has changed. 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 I like it on the rainbow one for more per reference. But uh it's like I said it's been reduced. I didn't say power reduce. Po uh, higher power. Higher power. Power has been increased. Screen color. Screen color. Color has changed. 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 So you get the idea. It's voice command, and I really like it like that. You can manually operate it by three times fast, get you into the settings, as you can see in there. Use the buttons to go down. Let me set it back at my uh, rainbow color light. Right there. And there we go, we got the rainbow color again. You can fade the light, you can do everything like that. The pros and the cons for this mod, let's see here. Um, the mod, there's a, there's a con about it. I, I can pick up a con right now. When I first got this mod, I put the batteries in, and, uh, let me show you, I'll take it apart. And, uh, I tried putting the batteries in. It's magnetic door, so you won't ever have a problem with that, and it's pretty sturdy. You shake it, it's not coming loose. Alright, but if you drop it, yeah, that, that might be an issue. So I take that off. As you see, like the mag kit. It has a battery pack. I don't really like it because it strips the battery protector off of the battery pack or off the batteries of yourself. You just gotta kind of juice it down and take it out without trying to damage your batteries. But see, I already kind of damaged mine. Um, yeah, fuck it. It's okay. I don't really care about damaged batteries. I mean, I never had problems with it. But then you kind of want to just snug it in. Hello, Master. I am your new warrior. And there we go. We got the mod. We got the nice little smock. Hello, Master. I am your new warrior. Hello, iPriv. Hello, iPriv. I am here. Change voice. Change voice. Voice change. Voice has changed. Voice change. Voice has changed. Voice change. Voice has changed. So there's three different voice changes. Uh, I've been puffing on this mod for a good day and a half now, and never gave me any trouble. So just another con about it I don't like is that I can really name off right away is that it overheats quite a bit. And once you get that low battery symbol to where you have to charge it, it's uh, it shuts off by itself and it acts like it's dead, like it, it loses power. But once you charge it, that there's no worries about it because once you charge it again, there's you really don't have no issues over it. It's just it has an automatic shutdown. It's a it's a wear fail, or whatever you want to call it. Um, it automatically charges. By Android, it comes with a little nifty Android charger. It does come with a voice command sheet that you need to know every voice command in order to get into all the settings and stuff. Like, hold on, let me shut down my mod so it doesn't doesn't read my voice. Hello, iPriv. Hello, iPriv. Hello, iPriv. I'm here. Shut down. Okay, so like, look, it says to start with waking up your warrior, it starts step one. Hello, iPriv is your command that you have to say. This, the voice will respond saying, I am here. Step two, command, codes, and voice response. 
my wattage, uh, higher power, lower power is to lower, and higher power is to higher wattage. Uh, shutdown is to shut it down and turn the mod completely off. Um, it's really nice instead of going all the way through your settings and manually doing it all the time. Um, because some of the, like the alien and mag kit you got to go three times fast on the trigger just to get into the settings or lock it and then hold the trigger to shut it off within five seconds it's kind of ridiculous i think um then you say hello i prepared for wattage mode you can say and it'll say wattage mode ready tc mode uh lock device unlock device switch on light turn off light light color to change the light color of any color you want Screen color to change any color you want. Voice change to change any voice you want between the three voices. Now, it did come with a really little nifty uh, charger cord for it. It's metal and it's tangle free. But it's not like rivel free, I can see, because as you saw, it's not rivel free. But it has the nice little smock. Uh, I got that bitch upside down, don't I? Smock little thing on the front, and it has a nice little adapter on the other end of uh, Android. And it's all metal, and it has springs coming out of the uh, end, so it's, st it's stretchable a little bit. Don't stretch it too far, or else it will be probably destroyed. Alright. Now, I do not only run the mess coil now. Um, my favorite coils are the Cloud Beast King. Because it goes up to 350 watts. That's the one I use. So I do have a Cloud Beast King tank too. I gotta find it. Oh, where did I put my tanks? Oh, uh, they're over here. So give me a second. I'll grab them. I got the nice little nifty silver Cloud Beast King tank. Right now I got the V8. TFV 12T, whatever it's called in there right now. And then I got me a nice little nifty 80 to 40, 40 to 80 watt, uh, print, uh, uh, what is this thing called? Um, Limitless Tank, that's what it's called. I, I had to think for a minute because I just woke up and I'm just starting these new YouTube blog videos because I just got hired for doing it. So, I'm kind of new at this. You gotta kind of hang in there for me. I'll get used to it while I'm doing it. Um, mainly, I'm doing it to uh, help you guys and the fans out that like vaping as much as me and my girl does. You might see my girl on the videos once in a while doing them too. Uh, I just gotta train her to do it and get her involved in it. Um, again, I go by Jackman. My girl goes by KK Bear. So, uh... As of right now, the videos are only going to be on YouTube only until I get the used to how to do it on Twitter, Instagram, and Facebook. Right now, I'm just doing it on YouTube. So, my main thing is about this vape, the pros and the cons. It has good detail. It has good, really nice uh, color to it. The cherry red, the button... It only works on top. Five times on to turn it on. It's a good priv. Voice command is a priv, uh, good positive about it. If you ever want to get the profile tank, my best bet would be to run it at 50 watts when you build your coil. If you don't know how to build coils, I'll do a video on that later when my coil gets old and I have to switch it out because... Uh, I kind of already did that yesterday before uh, I did the video. So I was going to show everybody how to do it again. But there's other videos out there that people do that you can watch and you will learn. I learned mine less than not even two thirty or 30 seconds uh, before I did it. And I was like, it was that easy? I was like, god damn, couldn't believe it. So I literally had to go out and get one of these uh, profile tanks. I heard it was really, really, really good, and the results on it is really, really good. They are. They're amazing. Here's what it looks like inside. Amazing little coil. If you can see it in there. Just don't want to 
tilt it all the way because my juice is in there right now. It'll leak out. I just had to clean it on my shirt, obviously. I don't really use tissue and stuff because when I think about these tanks are once you get tissue all over it, they pick up the uh they pick up the little dust particles and stuff off the tissue or off the paper towel and they stick because they are a really nice finished coat of paint. That makes it look at all looking all tacky and old and kind of nasty looking so I don't really like that I'm really clean about my vapes and my tanks and my coils and stuff I'm really really high picky about them um so later on once uh, I get to my boy's email address and stuff so you can put shout outs to him and everything when I learn how to do that I'll introduce that to the next video I do for when I make this coil when this coil goes out but if you ever want a new new mod and you're not know, knowing which one you should go with, watch these videos and I'll be helping you out. Tell you which ones you go with and you should go with. Because I'm the pro with the mods. I, I know how to do everything. I, I know people say that all the time, but I've been smoking mods since I was 15 and I've been building mods actually too. I actually get kits for like 125 bucks and I will assemble them personally to make them run by myself and higher wattage than what you really want them to do for professional uh, tricks and stuff like that. The little trick I learned uh, when I was just recently, long story short, in jail, I'll just end it like that, uh, when they had the vape pens that really don't do crap is this one right here. I can't really get it done right now. I usually can do O's though. It's all the way you position your mouth and you have to do it in a circle and stuff. So it's kind of hard, but I'm getting better at it. So then again, all these good tanks, all these products that I be getting, I basically get them for free. I ain't no charge for me, especially when I start doing these videos for him. And show them the results. Uh, I get them pretty much for free now. So be the first to message, subscribe, and comment below. And leave your information like cell phone number or house phone number. Especially an email address and address. If you want to enter the chance to win a free mod and products from me. And my boy Ron from Wonderland. That's who runs the Wonderland down here in Flint. I don't know how many Wonderlands there is out there. If you're close by one, be all means to get to know the owner of the place because they'll throw you details or good uh, discounts for sure. Because that's how I got to know him. I get really, really cheap discounts. I don't even have to pay tax for any of the uh, products when I buy them. So, like, say if something's like twenty-five bucks and twenty-nine ninety-nine or something like that, I only have to pay twenty bucks or twenty-nine bucks for it. Or he'll cut it down to like 25 bucks for me because I know him so well. So there you go. You got the YouTube video on uh, the Smock iPriv kit. Hope you guys like it. Come back and see me later. Don't forget, again, to comment, subscribe, and message or anything else to, to try to win a mod. Later on in a couple months because uh, I'll be keeping an eye out on that for you guys. I want you guys to be a vapor just like me. I need some vapor buddies. If you guys would like, you can uh, be my friend on Facebook. Link me up on uh, Jackman. That's my nickname for Facebook. My username. So look me up as Jackman. J-A-C-K space M-A-N.